one day break. Halloween is just barely behind us, but some people in Indianapolis already have their sights set on New Year's Eve. The masquerade at Union Station, it sells out every year, but Brenna Donnelly landed a special preview for us this morning, so she's down there to show us around, Brenna. Hey, good morning, guys. I've got some folks here who think you should completely skip the flight to New York City this New Year's Eve and instead come to downtown Indianapolis for a masquerade ball inside the beautiful Union Station. Take a look around here. I've got Emily Mack here from Indy Metro Development. Emily, why is it significant that this is here in Union Station? So this is the 100th and anniversary of this incredible facility. Um, this was completed in 1888, and it is the oldest Union Station in the United States. I couldn't believe that when I heard it. I'm like, you can think of all the other Grand Central Stations, Union Stations, but Indy had the first one. How long ago was that? Um, so the actual first facility that was on the site was completed in 1853. And it was the first time that anywhere in the country they had consolidated um, the railroads. And so um, at one time there were 200 trains and a half a million people that came through this facility on a daily basis. I can't even imagine. Now it's a beautiful ballroom. And this is a big chance for people to get inside this facility that they might have not been in for years. Right. Yeah, this is an absolutely incredible space. It was listed on the National Register of Historic Places in 1982. Um, it is an outstanding example of Richardson Romanesque architecture, and it is one of the architectural gems of the city of Indianapolis. Oh, it's wonderful. Emily, thank you. We're glad you're here today. Let me show you what else we've got coming up in the morning show, guys. Emily, thanks again. We've got some ballroom dancers here um, from Indianapolis Ballet. Also in the corner, if you can see, we've got Abby, who's who's working on her own performing art, making a piece of art. So throughout the morning, we're going to check in with the dancers and check in with Abby and learn more about what's going to happen at this masquerade event. But we can put the info up on your screen. Of course, it's New Year's Eve. It's in the beautiful Grand Central Hall here at Union Station. And we just hope you guys have a wonderful time enjoying what we have for you coming up at the top of every hour. Back to you. Cheerleaders, dancers, <laughs> this turned into a special daybreak Very all of a sudden. Very visual agenda there for you. you. <laughs> all right, Brenna, thank you.